Hi, I'm Wendy Gratz from Shiny Happy World, and I want to invite you to my class, Big Stitches and Patchy Patchwork. We're going to learn all kinds of great things in this class, starting with Big Stitch Quilting, which is a very fun, very loose, very relaxed kind of quilting. If you've never done any traditional hand quilting before, don't worry, this is a completely different kind of stitch. You don't need any handwork experience at all to do it. It uses running stitch, which is the very easiest hand stitch there is. We're going to be putting those big stitches on all kinds of great projects that are patchy patchwork, like you see behind me. I call it patchy patchwork because unlike tradi traditional pieced work, these patches are not sewn together with tiny little sashing strips between them. They're all applied to the surface of a whole cloth quilt. So you can do any kind of shapes that you want and you can be completely improvisational about it. You don't have to plan anything out ahead of time. We're going to work with irregular patches straight out of your scrap basket like you see behind me, but I'm also going to show you how you can do very precisely cut geometric patches, and I'm also going to show you how to get a perfectly turned edge on curved patches. You don't have to make a full-size quilt like you see behind me, although I am going to teach you how to do that. You can use the exact same technique to make smaller projects like wall hangings and even teeny tiny projects like a coaster that you could finish in a single evening. I'm going to show you a few different ways to finish your projects. I'm going to show you two different binding methods. One, my favorite binding method that's a combination of machine and handwork, and then a second binding method that is done entirely by hand and uses visible running stitches that will match the stitching in your quilts. I'm also going to show you two different ways to join quilt-as-you-go blocks. One method that's entirely by machine, and another method that's completely by hand. Again, anything that's 100% by hand, you can pack up and take anywhere with you, which is really, really great. I'm also going to show you how to make things with the fabric that you make. If you think of this technique as making fabric, you can then use that to make pillows. I'm going to show you my very favorite method for making a pillow. And I'm going to give you a bunch of patterns that are free for a couple of different size tote bags and a tablet cover. You're going to be able to make a lot of different things with the fabric that you make in this class. We're going to learn some great techniques and make some really fun projects, so I hope you'll join me. I can't wait to see what you make. 